of hates uh, having some kind of issue. I think Momochi's hair is just like <laughs> so slick that he couldn't figure out the proper way to balance it around the headset, and he had to have a consultant over there he to figure a, it out. A stylist. Okay, now they shake hands. And we're going to get a Kin mirror. Like we said, two contrasting Kin players. But look, the handshake was just like the match. You see Eita stand up and rush down Momochi <laughs> and go for the handshake. And Momochi played lame, and he Stood stayed up. solid, and he took the handshake. That's how it's going to look, just like that. The so, handshake is a good representation of how the match is going to go. So Green Kin, Momochi. The classic. Default Eita. Oh, man. Oh, wow. How one. did this happen? Fight. <laughs> he hit him with the, hit him with the friendly shot. The, the no friendly respect. fire. Fireball. I don't blame him. I would have did the same thing. <laughs> we got to start over. Fireball. That's what's going to happen. You see, it's like he looked over he at looked me, over, and he was like, 1-0. 1-0. One zero. <laughs> one one zero. Zero. He started. One zero. Oh, man. I got Ada. you. Yeah. Ada. You know he's you know he's the soul cow. He's taking the match. <laughs> we take those. We take those every day of our lives. I like how he looked right at me. He looked right. Like I had the jurisdiction. All right, here we go. Look, if it's another stage, it's two zero. I'm calling it. All right. It's two zero. All right, playing on every sheet stage. Not allowed. Oh man. All right, here we go. Shadow will base at night. Fight. Nice fireball. You see the patience from Omochi early. Crouch strong. Counter hit confirmed, man. Momochi is quite the guy. Man, look at the ranges that he's dashing in at and the buttons that he's committing to. And here comes Aza. Oh, man. This is a true mirror match. It confirmed for Momochi. Nice backup right there. Gets the crush counter in roundhouse. Confirms in the trigger. Aza still keeping that life lead pretty close right now. Yeah, and you see the stylistic difference. Oh, he's got him. He can get the X here. Not quite enough, but he needs one. One for the round. Nice. Blitz his range right there. Now V trigger for Momochi available. Okay, good uppercut from Atar. Oh, and there's the nice. normal. Sneaks in that low medium. Pick. And you see Aza trying to play like lame enough to make Momochi do something, and he's way too calculating for that. You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to do a little better than that if you want Momochi to flinch. Right, and Momochi, he, he's so good at that intercept, that whip punish, reactive style. And, you know, Eita, he wants to force him. He wants to be aggressive. It's really tough for him to make that happen against a player like Momochi. Again, the big bet, he thought it was gonna hit. Lots of damage right here. And this push to the corner. Back throw. Now he has the pressure. Uh oh, throw couple loops. of throws now. Oh, he gave up corner. All right, well he wants it back. Oh, nice crossing strong. Get that counter hit confirmed and the stun. Let's see the resources he spends here. Yeah, none. Cause there's too much scaling. Oh wow, another cross throw and in the back throw. What an offensive series from Eita. Just a bunch of throws. A couple of frame traps of Momochi. He he just fell from all. A bunch of meaty buttons to make sure he stays honest. Momochi, of course, way too smart to try to commit to wake up DP in situations up from here. Yeah, the damage swing there on a block DP is so high. Whip on ice. Good throw. Momochi keeps it relatively simple. Oh, oh. big jump. Yeah, Aza looked occupied. He just walked right into it again. One for stun. Oh, out of range. For the throw. Not bad. Oh, wow. Nice, nice whip punish attempt there by Momochi. Yeah, that back strong. Yeah, that queued up. Interrupt. And look at how good he is at stopping that forward momentum. Nice. Momochi smothering. Can win. Okay, I think they're going to go back to stage select. He's not feeling it. He wants to go back to the airplane stage. <laughs> so he can get another game. Uh, but yeah, it seems like that was what he said. Or character select. So... We've seen uh, Eita, when he did take that round, a lot of meaties came out. He would get a knockdown, meaty, just to see how Momochi would react. And like I said before, Momochi's way too calculated to take the bait for certain things, so they kind of gave him a, a, a leg up, a small advantage. Didn't work out too long, but it did give him a glimmer of hope. Yeah. So, of course, your favorite stage, the Halloween stage, because oh. you love the song. It's a great stage, Steve. I like it. It's a great song. It totally fits. <laughs> Come on. 
All right, I do more. like, uh, you know, I like that in the spirit of the Halloween stage, the Ken players are playing the outfit where Ken's face, he's got the mask on. <laughs> That's all of them. Throw that time. Ah, oh, that was a, an excellent punish. You know, Momoshi did not cancel there because he didn't have EX meter. Uh, nothing probably would have comboed at that distance. Man, Momochi is just tightening up more and more as these matches go on. What patience to block that run up fierce. She's so calculated. But Eita, so insistent. Great uppercut. He's had the better anti air so far. Oh, wow. Look at this pressure again. This is what I was talking about before. Crouching Strong is getting him so much mileage. There's a Crouching Strong for Momochi. Oh, oh trade. wow. Yeah, it looked like Wake Up Tatsu. Eita, he just needs the one pop and he could be in there. Looking for anything to be blocked. Any physical attack. Maybe a cancel in the fire. Punish. Oh, oh, what a miss from Eita. That was huge. Momochi rarely misses that. Oh, he's the back throw. And then, just like that, a couple of throws. Man, a big miss on that target combo. How often do you see Momochi fire that bad yeah, play that's, out? Yeah, that lets you know. Maybe that randomness is getting to him a little bit. That's what'll happen. Just the unorthodox style of Eita. Crushed. Oh. Good old February mix-up. And look at this offensive push by Aita right now. And he corners himself. Aita's not afraid because, yeah, look, he'll run you down. He doesn't care where he is on the screen. He just wants the offense. He just wants the stun. And was working on a perfect and a stun right there. Wake up, crouch strong in the fireball. Tries to use that B-skill to get back in. Okay. Nice. It's going to be fun -ish. A big, uh... Chance. Oh, oh, the other side. Man, that was a crazy oh, mix-up. Wow. No stun gonna go up from this critical off, but a lot of life gonna be lost right now, and you're gonna get a mix-up. Dash up. No. The walk. You see the patience. Oh, wow. And Ata comes back one match apiece right now. Man, it seems like Momochi's reaching just a pitch too far. Just a small tad. And that's what's making him lose his match. Look, it's this fast-paced music. You know what I'm saying? It's throwing Momochi off. It's this. This BPM is too high, and now he has started to Fight. miss a few things. Oh wow, gets put by that top two. Nice autocorrect DP right there. Tried to become the repeat offender, but then there's the O. Oh, oh wow, double trade right there. I love that hit stun animation. <laughs> yeah, it's so good. The real back. Crush. Crush counter. Maximizes. Look at all that red damage on the bar right there. Oh, and the V-reversal just to stuff it. That's the first V-reversal we've seen from this, this set right here. Look at Momochi, got him. Back throw, that's maximum stun and meter build as well. Very optimal play for Momochi. And Aita seems like he's making Momochi come out of this zone where he wants to play comfortably. I, I like it, I mean, it, it seems like it's gonna take a long time, but it definitely, you can see the effects of it already. Uppercut, yeah, and Aita's uppercut and tiers have been excellent so far. Nice. You see Aita just starting to wait a little more, and I feel like he's doing so much better playing this way. Yeah, no check on the rough of Omochi. Rare. Oh, His reactions wow. are so good, he got mixed up by back rolling. Frame trap attempt. Oh man, Aita hit the button. So no risky. Still finds that back media punch target combo. Oh man, big risk from Aita. Oh, he got him. What? And one round apiece. He's making Momochi crack. I think he's really starting to frustrate the style of Momochi. He's not ready. To, you know, this reactive Final style round. is important, but when your opponent just has such an unpredictable pattern, it's really tough to keep up. Ooh. Oh, throw. Yeah, nice game to get out of there. See, Momochi, he's scared of the uppercut from Aza, so he doesn't always want to pressure. Uppercut, yes. Now almost full gauge from Momochi. Oh, wow. Ace is gonna spin it. Spin that critical art. It is the last round. You got nothing but time and space right now. Oh yeah, you see the throw from downtown. Oh. And again, Ata's uppercuts are so consistent. There's another back throw from Ata. It's time to throw from Momochi. Another gear personal attempt and the oh, uppercut loses. Stuff. Oh no, confirming oh. the critical art. Oh, oh wake up button! Might be dead. Oh, yeah. Wow. And that cost him the match 2 1 in favor of Aita right now versus Momochi. That is that style. And 
and Momochi cannot figure out the timing on when there's going to be the wrist. He cannot figure it out. Like, Eita is just stumping him here. All right, Momochi. And you see that Round exasperated one. sigh right there from right. Momochi. Like, man, what is happening right now? Who does this guy think he is? Ah, yeah. Yeah. But wow. Wrist. I'll do it too. You know, at the end of that last game, right, Eita had that wake up button, and I think Momochi was like, yeah, I'll meet you. Wake up, media punch, dragon punch. Again. The wrist. Nice Tatsu to get out of there. Ooh, nice auto correct. Again. Again! You're not gonna do that to me. Finds the crouching strong. Here comes Aiden. Nice break on the throw. No ants here from Momochi again. And every time he tries to get something started, crouching strong from Ada works every time. That's gonna hurt a lot. We'll see what it is from Ada on wake up. You see Momochi play so patient, he's afraid of that uppercut. And you gotta be at this point. Oh, oh late fires a hit, not close enough. Crouching strong. Gets the back door, it's not over. Chip, get chip. Yeah, oh, wow. that was that. No matter what, Ata was gonna cancel that into critical. Art. And now match point over Momochi. Round two. Didn't even have to spend the Peter. Man, Ada is playing out of his mind right now. And we talked about this. We talked about the fact that Momochi is so calculating. It is going to be really hard for them to keep track of what Ada wants to do. All right, Media is good this time. Does he guess right? Oh, just out of range. Dash up, crouching strong again. That Media crouching strong done such so much mileage. What up? Honest. He has one more for stun. He will beat Momochi here if he can get the mix up. He's dead. Oh, wow. He should be dead. If he doesn't drop it, Aita's going to eliminate Momochi. Oh, wow. And Aita considered, considered the wild guy, the wild kin player. Representing, representing that new representing sponsor. Did you see the Frieza? <laughs> Tell me you saw that. Yeah. The Frieza? Oh. This guy is out of control. What a what a way to send Momochi out of the tournament with.